Welcome to the Descara Accounting Demo. We're going to be going over a few items on the dashboard page during this particular webinar. The dashboard page is what you're looking at currently. It consists of several different components. What it is is a workspace to give you the effective tools to manage and monitor information about all of your accounts. Across the top of the screen, you'll find several administrative tabs to assist in many basic functions. The first one we come to is Account Preferences. In here, this allows you to configure settings for financial year, book beginning year, account settings, email, inventory, and automatic number generation for various transactions such as invoice, payments, credit note, and debit note, among many others. The next tab is Fixed Asset Depreciation. This allows you to record fixed asset value, configure its salvage value, and life, as well as view and post fixed asset depreciation right from the screen. You'll notice on all of these screens an export capability is listed to export into a CSV or a PDF and in some cases right into an XLS file. The next tab across the top is Bank Reconciliation. This allows you to compare the accounting records against those shown on your bank statement as well as identify discrepancies between these records and their probable causes. The next tab across the top is the Currency Exchange. In here you can maintain a date-wise comprehensive record of exchange rates for various currencies with respect to the home currency. The next tab we come to across the top is the audit trail. This allows you to track all the user activities by maintaining comprehensive accounting records. A click through and IP address of every click that's made is listed on this page. So identifying where things went wrong or how things are going well is easy to do. The next tab we come to across the top is the master configuration. This is where you can define the settings for payment method, payment terms, unit of measure, and tax. The next tab is user administration. In here you can define roles and permissions for the users in the system. This is done on a per item basis, as you can see. Sales by item is just that. It's a list of all of your items with the sales generated below them. These are all collapsible, as you can see here. You can also get a summary, of, uh, a summary report of all of the items listed in a single quantity. This concludes the initial accounting demo for Descara. Thank you.